Hi, I'm Nathan from Py3G and today I'm going to show you how you can set up a Halo NPU, so a neural processing unit, with your Raspberry Pi 5 so that you can run real-time camera demos using an AI neural network accelerator. Whether you're experimenting with object detection or pose estimation, this guide has you covered. Before we get started, here's what you will need. A Raspberry Pi 5, one of the following NPUs, which is either the Raspberry Pi AI kit, which includes an M.2 Head Plus and a pre-installed Halo 8 L AI module, or the Raspberry Pi AI Head Plus. The Raspberry Pi AI Head Plus has a Halo 8 module with 26 Tera operations built into it. Then you will also need a 64-bit Raspberry Pi OS bookworm, and of course any official Raspberry Pi camera, like the Camera Module 3 or the High Quality Camera. The first step is to set up your hardware. So start by attaching your camera to the Pi. Just follow the official Raspberry Pi camera instructions. Next, install your AI Kit or AI Head Plus, depending on what you have. It is important to power off your Raspberry Pi before this step. Then, for best performance, it's highly recommended to enable PCIe Gen 3. Now let's install the software dependencies for the NPU. Open a terminal and run sudo apt install halo all. This installs the halo kernel driver, firmware, middleware and post-processing libraries and the RPyCam apps. Once everything is installed, reboot your Pi with sudo reboot and after rebooting verify the NPU is correctly installed by running halo-rt-cli fw-control-identify. You should see details like the firmware version, board name and serial number. If you're using the AI Head Plus, don't worry if some fields show as NA, that's normal. You can also double check that the device is working as intended by checking the kernel logs. Next, we need to test if the camera is working properly. The command rpcam hello t 10s should show a preview window for 10 seconds. If that works, you're ready for the fun part, which is running some demos. To test out the different models, you can use the rpcam hello command with t set to 0, which means infinite duration. Then you have to provide a post-process file and there's plenty of versions for you to choose from. I have cut together a simple demo sequence and tested how the different models would perform. I have tested the V6, V8 and X model with the AI Kit and AI Head Plus, so the 13 Tera operations and 26 Tera operations variant. You can see that the models are picking up cars very nicely and it also works very well on persons. However, animals and large geographical features are detected rather poorly. Everyday objects like paintings, vases, flowers, tables are detected rather consistently, but larger objects are often omitted. The models didn't detect any stars or galaxies on images of the James W. Webb telescope However, sometimes they misclassified space nebula as pizza. Another interesting effect can be seen at the vegetable market. Oftentimes the models confuse vegetables and fruits and misclassify some of them. So with that the use case of these NPUs is very clear. They are good at detecting persons and cars 
and a bunch of everyday objects. But if you need to differentiate between special objects, they don't work that well right out of the box. I also ran a quick demo of the YOLO V8 pose detection model, which I thought worked very well. So what do you think of the AI kit and AI head? How do you like the Halo 8 modules? Let me know in the comments what you would like to build with these and what you think you could use these for.